I'm Ali Tamposi, and you're watching New You. Well, how does it feel to be here tonight? It feels awesome. This is um, this is always an, the event of the year for me. Um, it's beautiful how BMI really does put on an, an, an incredible event, event to celebrate songwriters because I don't feel like songwriters get as much recognition as they deserve. Not that any songwriter would want anymore. I know I don't. I'm not big on you know going out and doing events, but it's beautiful that there is this to celebrate. Fabulous. Yeah, it is a great night. Great night. And now you've written some hit songs. Can I ask you, take me through your songwriting process. Where do you get your inspiration? Um, well, I usually write with um, Brian Lee and Andrew Watt. And so we usually go into the studio and kind of, you know, we all talk about our own shit that's going on at, at you know, at that that day. And, and um, you know, Andrew Watt will usually come up with a crazy chord progression and we'll all shoot out melodies and, and um, pick the best ones and then talk about a concept and really like tap into these, tap into our soul, honestly, and, and, and find that like sweet spot that, that gives you that like, you know, that those chills or that feeling, yeah. And it's a really beautiful process. It's, it's extremely stimulating for me as a writer to be able to express my story um, without having to be an artist. And, and I feel like artists are relating to that um, and if we are writing with an artist, I usually take the time to really get to know them and understand what they're going through and tap into their vulnerabilities and act as like act as if a thera I'm a therapist and and it's um it, yeah it's it's a wonderful job. I, I'm extremely grateful to be able to wake up and write a song every day. It's it's fantastic. Now you touched on having artist input. Can you tell me a little bit about that? How it is working with the artist? How much input that they have into the songwriting process? I think it, it varies. Um, it varies between artists. Um, sometimes they'll just give me a, a, a concept, or we'll just talk and and get, and I'll tap into you know, into them as like in, into their place and see you know, and then I'll take what they t I'll take their story and then kind of run with it. Um, or and then in, in other cases, there's an artist that's an incredible songwriter that likes to be extremely involved in the process, and and it's just like writing with another songwriter. Fantastic. Now, lastly, we focus a lot on health at New You. Do you have a piece of health advice that you would give young people? I'd say um, just wake up every morning and try and, you know, and think of the things that you're grateful for. Um, I know that sounds so cheesy, but that's kind of like what I do. I think um, I've been trying, you know, I'm like self-help obsessed recently. Um, and I just try and, you know, I've been meditating recently. Um, but yeah, I just think it's, you know, the media and social media especially, it, um, it, it's like it's, it makes it very hard to like find your true self. And I think it puts a lot of pressure on, on, um, on our, you know, all generations. And I think that, um, you know, just to kind of like find ways to connect with people through, without, through, you know, that are in ways that are not through the social media, not through the phone and just... Yeah, and find a life that isn't, um, isn't a virtual life, I guess.